It's Kyle here, and it's been a while since I've done a movie review on this channel. I just happened to see a great movie I enjoyed a lot today, so I thought, why not review it? And it was World War Z. Now, I've read the book World War Z, loved it a lot. It's one of my favorite books I've read in the past um, 10 years or so. In fact, I did a book review for it on Reread Books. I'll put a link to that book review in the description box below. Check that out. If you haven't read the book yet, I highly recommend it. It's an awesome book. Um, no, if you have read the book, don't let the fact that the movie's different from the book scare you away. Um, yes, it's not really what World War Z the book is. It's completely different. Really, the only two things it has in common is there's zombies in it, and it has the same title. I guess a small third thing, the UN is kind of involved in the, the plot of the movie and the book. But really, they took the movie in a completely different direction than the book. So at this point, it's almost better to think of it. There are two different things. They just happen to have the same title. Uh, the other thing I wanted to say, if you're typically not a big horror movie fan, so you really don't like zombie movies, don't let that scare you away from World War Z. World War Z is much more an action movie that happens to have zombies in it and not a horror movie that's based around zombies. Now, there are a few scary moments, uh, at least the theater I was, there's a couple points where people were startled and you had a few screams, but for the most part, it's an action movie that just happens to have zombies as the bad guy. The cast is great. I want to give big props to that. There was never really an actor in the movie that thought, you know, you're doing an awful job. Why in the world did they cast you? So big props to all the actors in it. Brad Pitt did an amazing job. The effects in the movie is great. Um, the makeup on the zombies is great. I mean, they really made them look unique, interesting. I mean, they really did look like zombies. I mean, they did an amazing job in that aspect of it. Now, is it the best movie I've ever seen? No. Is it the best action movie I've ever seen? No, but it's a very entertaining movie. So I've already seen one person describe this way on the internet um, for this movie, and I'd kind of go the same route. It's one of those movies like you really should go to watch it in the theaters at least once, but it's not the type of movie you really want to go back and watch multiple times in the theater. It'll be, you know, it's a good movie, not quite a great movie in some aspects, um, but it's one of the better zombie movies I've seen in a long time. Really enjoyed it a lot. I'd probably place it right around there 28 days later. Now, I know a lot of people argue is 28 days later a zombie movie or not, but why well, argue about stuff like that? So I really enjoyed World War Z a lot. If you're looking to see a good action movie, go see it. It's great. Um, I recommend it. Like I said, if you haven't read the book yet, definitely consider doing that. And remember to check out my book review in the description box below. Hope you enjoyed their review, and if you saw World War Z, let me know what you thought of it in the comment section below. Hope you enjoyed their review, and I'll see you the next time.